Hello everyone and welcome to Sun Up. I'm Lyndall Stout. Last week's rainfall across Oklahoma was definitely a sight for sore eyes, but was the moisture enough to make a difference in the wheat fields that needed it the most? To get up to speed, here's our small grains extension specialist, Dr. Amanda Silva. So we started the plot tours uh, last week, southwest, covering the southwest region, south central, and I was very surprised with what I saw. There's some good looking wheat fields. Um, of course, we're not still up to our potential in those good looking fields, but I'm saying for the, considering the conditions we've had, uh, there are some good looking uh, wheat fields in the area. Although driving around, you also see some areas that the wheat, the wheat just looks very poor. Western uh, area of Oklahoma, we had some fields that were abandoned due to drought. We are seeing some freeze damage on, on top of that drought stressed uh, crop. And it seems like this year we might see a, a switch from areas than, when we saw, than what we saw last year. So last year, our worst part of the wheat production was more in the southwest area. But I think this year, maybe uh, our best uh, production will come from southwest and southern part of the state. Uh, other things, uh, in general, disease pressure is really low. Uh, we have seen some reports of virus diseases, so like wheat streak mosaic. Uh, we also had some issues with uh, spider mites, brown wheat, brown wheat mites. But overall, we do have a lot of issues with the drought. We all know, yes, we got some rain. That was great. And however, in some situations that uh, the yield is not there anymore. So now we really hope to, to get that, that rainfall uh, con to continue so we can fill the grains that, that are out there. You know, there is a very high need for hay. Hay prices are also very good. So even in those areas where we are seeing very, very good uh, wheat fields, we may not see the, uh, them uh, being harvested. So there are a lot of people considering uh, har uh, cutting the wheat for hay. And so we'll see, uh, it, this will likely be another year where we have our harvest acres down, yields uh, down. But uh, like I said, hopefully we'll, we'll continue to have some rain so we can feel the grains that are out there. Uh, you know, the, the conditions uh, are not what we would like to see. It's a, very, it's a very unfortunate year, again, for our wheat production in Oklahoma. However, we continue doing that research, so we have our variety trials around the state, and we'll continue providing that information to growers. Yeah, so we'll be moving at, to our uh, north central plots, uh, so the La Homa Field Day will be on May 19th. We'll also be uh, at northwest panhandle area, so we still have a lot more to, to cover and I look forward to seeing everybody there.